okay so in this lesson we are going to see how to download angular.js see angular.js is a library so we have to download how to download first we have to go to angular.js.org website this is the official website of angular.js so once we open the angular.js website we have to click on download option so once we click on download then we click on the latest version that is 1.4.x so once we click on 1.4.x and then we click on uncompressed so what is the difference between minified and uncompressed see uncompressed means what it contains a full source code as it is the actual source code of angular js is available as uncompressed so the code will be a bit lengthy but minified means same code but in a shortcut format where there are no comments no line breaks no spaces and short and variable names this is a minified version so in real time applications especially while developing uncompressed is recommended but at the time of uploading the project into the server it is recommended to use minified during development uncompressed is recommended at the time of uploading into project minified is the best in case of zipped what happens is angular js and all its related libraries will be downloaded which means that the main angular js file plus angular js animations plus angular js routing like that many additional libraries are downloaded so presently timing i prefer uncompressed i click on uncompressed then i click on download option so once i click on download then i am selecting desktop angular.js is a file name click on save so the file is being downloaded so once the file is download finished so this is the file what we have so we have to use this particular file in our application means we have to copy paste this particular file into the application folder so how to do that so first we have to create an application folder in any drive for example i'm just going to c drive and creating a folder like angular.js in this particular folder i'm creating the angular.js application so we have to copy this particular file into this new folder so right click copy paste so now in the same folder we have to save the html file so let's go to edit plus then html head body so this is the starting point of the html program ending point of the html program starting point of the non content ending point of the non content starting point of the body ending point of the body now let's give title angular js first example now so here we have to import the angular js file script src equal to angular dot js actually type equal to text by javascript attribute is there but it is optional so script src equal to file name what is the meaning of this particular code this particular code will send request to angular dot js file so all this script will be imported into the browser memory so once we have imported then we can call any functions of the angular js so let's save this where we have to save in the same folder we have to save 
file name I am giving first.html. So check like this HTML file, Angular file, JS file both should be in the same folder. Now, how do we create the Angular JS application? Div. So I want to make this div as Angular JS application. How can I make? By giving ng app. Once we have created Angular JS application, inside the Angular JS application, we can use any Angular JS concepts. For example, we have a concept called as expressions. Expressions is Angular JS concept. So what this expression means? Do some calculation and display the result. For example, we have written an expression 10 plus 20. So Angular JS will calculate this and display the result in the same place. So save it and execute the HTML file. So double click on the HTML file. Then it will execute. So it will show 30. So who has calculated 10 plus 20? Not HTML. Angular JS. Which means that if you don't give ng app, Angular JS cannot identify it. So it will display the same thing as it is. In case you have given ng app but don't import the Angular JS file, at the time also it will show the same. So Angular JS file should be imported and also ng app is compulsory. So ng app says that this div tag is the Angular JS application. Inside the Angular JS application only we can use Angular JS concepts such as expressions, directives, filters, many more. So this is the first example of AngularJS. So in the further sessions, we will continue.